Oh my gosh! She's Missy in trouble. She's in big trouble. Sorry about that. Oh my gosh! These are all the petitions, all the refusals. These are all the no. We don't want Missy or Harry or Missy, Missy, Missy. Yes, yes, yes. Hello. Yeah, I got. I, yes, I just received it through the mail. Uh, yeah, the driver. I don't know who's paying for that driver, but he was very kind enough to bring me over these papers for me to verify them during the night because he knocked on my door around two o'clock in the morning. Gosh, Missy, do you never learn? You never learn that people are now that you're not royal anymore. I am sorry. You have to respect other people's sleep. You know, I sleep, Missy. I close my eyes and I have dreams. I only have good dreams. Yes, I only have good dreams. Sorry, I don't know about you. I only have good dreams. <laughs> You're already a nightmare wheel. Okay, so let's go over. I know the rejections. I heard about the reject. No, you're not going to sue anybody. Already sued half of the world. So forget about that because, you know, the 31st is TikTok, TikTok, and TikTok. Yeah, okay, so let's go. Okay, these are the ones, Missy, that we're going to talk about Harry's day. Uh, yeah, we're going to talk. No, we're going to talk about Harry's day today, what's going to happen and all that. I don't think it's going to work, Missy. I really don't think so. No, okay. The thing is, Harry's going to wake up in the morning. He's going to think, uh oh. I don't have a charity to go to. I don't have a royal duty to go to. I don't have a palace to go to. I don't have a countryside to go to. What am I going to do? So that's going to be his every single day, wake up day life. Are you willing to put up with that, Missy? Because that's what's going to happen with Harry. Because every single day, ever since he was born, born, Missy, it's been 35, 36 years old. Because I don't know how old you people are. Because you get younger and he just gets older. So, you know, it's getting confusing now. So anyways, Missy, the thing, you're going to be the one to decide what you're gonna do with your hubby i don't know i think you're gonna kick him out to the curb we all know that you're gonna kick him to the curb but pretend okay so maybe you should give him some chores like let's say every monday you recharge the the, the, the baby doll's batteries every tuesday you can sweep you know around the corners or check the corners if everything's okay because i know that you're running out of money you're not going to be able to you know have all those maids and stuff like that. so that's going to be a problem number one on the 31st is what will harry do every single day because he has nothing to do besides being a royal yeah it's going to be a huge problem missy that's going to be a big problem welcome to the real world i mean he's gonna, he's unhappy with the real world he's no no <laughs> he's not happy with the real world you're used to the real world and you wanted to jump into more than amazing fantastic world but harry for harry to go into your world of, mm, i don't know it doesn't work it's easy for you to go in but it's also easy for them to kick you out that's what they're doing they're kicking you I out you know you're not welcome in you're not welcome anymore. Yeah, I know, Missy, I know. But the thing is, Harry's not used to it. He's he's not going to get used to the, the normal life. The day-to-day, -day, uh, silly, normal, struggling, hard, normal life. It's not going to work. It's not going to work. It's not going to last a week. So I think that's why he went over to Granny and asked Granny to go back. Yeah. But I think Granny is just welcoming one. She's not even welcoming the baby doll. She's welcoming one, and that one is here. Okay, so, yeah, don't cry, Missy. You're, you're not to, you can't cry anymore now, Missy, because now you're going to have to, you know, own it, own it. Because, you know, you're sassy, you're nasty, you're deceitful. You know how to do all these stuff. Okay, where's M.A.? Mm -hmm. Where is he? Yeah, you're your buddy-buddy that's, you know, together with you and all this mess. Okay, yeah, he's trying to figure out what, yeah, oh, yeah, he's, yeah, I know, he has to put his, his other peanut brain to work. I mean, I don't know if he's a cashew nut. You're a peanut and he's a cashew. <laughs> Okay, moving on, Missy, moving on. Okay, all these rejections. Okay, here's the thing. Hollywood doesn't need you, honey. Hollywood does not need you. You need Hollywood. You need Lion King. You need, uh, you know, and the big shot was fired. The big shot was fired because he gave you all that money. What did you do with all that money? I mean, I know you put it in your pocket, but, you know, let's pretend that you had to buy some new clothes to do the voiceover. Buy some new makeup just to do the voiceover, even though you're not even going to show. But I think they canceled your voiceover, Missy. Yeah, I don't know. You bought the wrong clothes, Missy. Maybe you bought the wrong clothes. You do everything so wrong oh my gosh you do everything so wrong okay so we've been through the rejections of the voiceover what are you gonna do hmm? yeah you know you, you're used to you're not getting younger missy you're not getting younger they're gonna get a because they get models of 10 years old to look like they have i mean 10 years old did you see the skin have you seen the skin of a 10 year old it's beautiful so the models for us ladies over 30 to you know they make these commercials for creams and all that but they use a 10 12 year old that's that's a problem missy they're not going to use you i'm sorry <laughs> oh missy what are you going to do ads for weaves and all that no it doesn't work it doesn't work people don't like to show that they have something in their hair okay now we're going to the petitions mm-hmm yeah, the petitions are bigger than the rejections because 
you know, you try once, you try twice, and then you just quit, okay? Quit the quit because nobody wants you in Hollywood, Missy. They don't need you in Hollywood. You're the one who needs them. They don't need you. Okay, so let's go for the petitions. Oh my gosh, Missy, so many petitions. Okay, Canada's not paying anything. Uh, UK, there's a petition going on. They're not paying anymore for anything. Uh, all of these are other countries. There are some countries here that I don't even know how to, you know. I've never heard about these countries here. Never, ever, ever. It, yeah, none of them want you. None of them want you just like the corona. They don't want you just like the corona, Missy. Yeah, the corona's not welcome just like you. Mm? Oh my gosh, so many petitions that I don't know, Missy. There's so many, many petitions going on. I don't know how you're going to do it. Let's see. I don't know. You're not welcome in the UK. You're not welcome in the US of A. You're not welcome in all the other countries that you went and you cried and all that. You're not welcome anywhere, Missy. What am I going to do with you? Oh my, Missy, Missy, Missy. Okay, baby Archie. Okay. Like, please, Missy, stop pretending there's a baby Archie. So tired of this non-existent baby Archie. You, you have no, I no idea, Missy, how sick and tired I am. And the whole world is sick and tired of there is no baby Archie. You cannot take baby Archie because baby Archie is teething. You cannot travel with baby Archie because there's a, the flu is going around the world. You cannot travel with baby Archie because, you know, the entire flight is empty, but there's not room for baby Archie's diapers. Oh, Missy, please forget about it. Baby Archie is God never existed, he doesn't exist, and we all know that, so please, please, pretty please, stop talking about baby Archie, baby Archie does not exist, woman, okay, it's coming soon, divorce is coming soon, is he, divorce is coming soon, okay, you're not going to the gala, you're not going anywhere, you're not, I doubt, okay, are you going on the 5th of March to the UK, no, you're not gonna go to the UK, you must, yeah, where are you now, Missy, hmm? Everybody's trying to guess. You're not in Canada. I know you're not in Canada. You've been kicked out of that mansion. Yeah, I know. No. So the 5th of March, you're not going anywhere because maybe you're going to come down with the flu together with your baby doll. But are you teething as well, Missy? <laughs> Missy, Missy, come back, Missy. I am just kidding. Missy's teething together with baby Archie. <laughs> Missy's teething together with her baby. Oh, isn't that a cutie? <laughs> Oh my gosh.